the first generation of blockchain platforms, collectively known as Blockchain 1.0 networks, were capable of capturing and recording data, but not acting upon it. Bitcoin, the world's first mass-scale blockchain, was designed to capture and record the transfer of Bitcoin from one owner to the next. At the time, nobody was envisioning blockchain as a platform on top of which applications and solutions could be built. The release of Ethereum in 2015 changed this model. Blockchain 2.0 was born, and now blockchain networks could not only capture data, they could act upon it as well. All of this was made possible by the introduction of a technology called smart contracts. And put quite simply, a smart contract is some computer code deployed to a blockchain network. Users can transact with the smart contract just as they would another user, except when transacting with a smart contract, the rules defined in the code are used to process the transaction. This advancement now allows blockchain solutions to manage and automate processes and record the results on a permanent, immutable, secure ledger shared with all relevant parties. Consider the sale of a used car. Alice lists her car for sale and offers a guarantee to any buyer that the car will be trouble-free for 1,000 miles. Bob looks at Alice's car and makes her an offer of $5,000. Alice and Bob agree that Alice will take half the purchase price now, $2,500, and the other half if the car has no major issues in the first 1,000 miles of Bob's ownership. A smart contract could be created between Alice and Bob. The smart contract would hold the remaining $2,500 in escrow. And if Bob had an issue with the car, he would report it to the smart contract. After 1,000 miles, the smart contract will determine how much of the remaining funds are due to Alice and how much should be returned to Bob using the rules Alice and Bob initially agreed upon. All details about the transaction would be recorded on a permanent, decentralized ledger, which could be used at any point in the future to answer any questions about the transaction between Alice and Bob.